What's going on guys? Okay, so this is an experiment I've wanted to try for a really long time. Oftentimes when anglers catch fish, they just have to cut them off at the leader. Usually this is because the fish have teeth and the angler doesn't have the proper tools at the time to remove it safely. This is a common practice with shark fishing. Now we're always told this will be fine for the fish because the saltwater will just rust the hook out within a couple days. But I want to find out just how long it will actually take for the hook to rust enough to break away off the fish. We're going to do the test with this 16 aught shark hook and uh, keep track of the progress. All right, so it's been exactly six weeks, and I'll let you compare the difference. As you can see, it just has some basic surface rust, which I can rub off with my hands um, and almost bring it to a clean finish the way it was before. I think it's safe to say if this hook was interfering with the fish's digestive system, it would be dead by now. Now, I'm sure with smaller, thinner hooks, this process is accelerated tremendously, but if this was stuck in a shark's digestive system, it would be good as dead. I'm not sure if these are stainless steel hooks. I don't know if that plays any difference, because I have seen that shark hooks are often black. I don't know if that's a carbon steel that rusts much faster, but um, the six weeks in salt water hasn't affected this at all.